take any action as president to slow the climate crisis? So I want absolutely immaculate, clean water, and I want absolutely clean air, and we had it. We had H2O. We had the best numbers ever, and we did — we were using all forms of energy, all forms, everything. And yet, during my four years, I had the best environmental numbers ever. And my top environmental people gave me that statistic just before I walked on the stage, actually. I don't know where the hell he's been. The idea that anything he said is true. I've passed the most extensive, most extensive climate change legislation in history. In history. We find ourselves, and by the way, black colleges, I, I came up with $15 billion for HBCUs, historic black universities and colleges, because they don't have the, they don't have the kind of contributors that they have to build these laboratories and the like. Any black student is capable in college of doing any white student can do. They just have the money, but now they'll be able to get those jobs in high tech. We're in a situation where the idea that he is claiming to have done something that had the cleanest water, the cleanest water, he hadn't done a damn thing for the environment. He pulled out of the Paris Peace Accord, uh, Climate Accord. I immediately joined it because if we reach 1.5 degrees Celsius at any one point, where there's no way back. The only existential threat to humanity is climate change. And he didn't do a damn thing about it. He wants to undo all that I've done. The Paris Accord was going to cost us a trillion dollars, and China nothing, and Russia nothing, and India nothing. It was a ripoff of the United States. And I ended it because I didn't want to waste that money because they treat us horribly. We were the only ones. It was costing us money. Nobody else was paying into it. And it was a, it was a disaster. But everything that he said just now, I'll give you an example. I heard him say before, insulin. I'm the one that got the insulin down for the seniors. I took care of the seniors. What he's doing is destroying all of our medical programs because the migrants coming in, they want everybody. And look, I have the, I have the biggest heart on the stage, I guarantee you that. And I want to take care of people. But we're destroying our country. They're taking over our schools, our hospitals, and they're going to be taking over Social Security. He is destroying Social Security, Medicare, and Medicaid.